good luck. Hello. Hello. How are you? Scared. Don't be scared. <laughs> Simon does bite, but don't be scared. OK. All right. What's your name? Alice Frednam. And how old are you, Alice? I'm 28. 28, and you're from where? Hertfordshire. Do you have a day job? I'm a beauty therapist. Okay, have you brought anyone with you today? No. <laughs> no? So your family don't know that you're here? No, I didn't tell anyone because I just thought I'd rather just go it alone and then if I'm not successful, I don't have to admit that to anyone. <laughs> Whenever you're ready. Good luck. Okay. Thanks. Stage fright is something I've battled with. I'm just trying to take each minute as it comes. Someone says no, it's like... For me, it's like, you're not good enough. That's where I think most of this, the, like, nervousness comes from, is that, I, you know, that, that people say no. I really want to succeed because I feel like I'm failing myself more than anything. I want to prove to everybody I'm here for something, something more than what they maybe thought. been waiting for. Your voice is like liquid gold. You have such an authentically beautiful voice. You look amazing. <laughs> and you 
you know, you could sing the phone book. Uh, I absolutely love you and I love your voice. And I also love the fact that you actually don't even know how good you are. Wow. I have to say that was the most mesmerizing, sultry, sexy performance. And I fell in love with you. Alice, why are you crying? <laughs> I just don't think I ever expected this kind of response. It was like my dream, and now it's just happened. <laughs> when you sing, you're like a goddess. It's incredible. <laughs> World class. Sniveling everywhere. <laughs> I think Deck fancies you a little bit, doesn't he? More than a little bit. <laughs> so, Alice, and nobody knows you're here today? No, because I, I just didn't want to let anyone down, so I thought I'd just come by myself. It was simply beautiful. Thank you so much. And you've much. let no one down. Thank you. OK, we're going to vote. Exactly. David. I can't wait to hear you sing again. It's a yes. It's a yes from me too. Yes. Thank you. Simon, yes or no? Oh, let me think about this. <laughs> Alice, what is it, Frednum, Frednum? Like Debenhams, Frednum. Alice Frednum. <laughs> I want to remember this name, the day I met Alice Frednum, because I think you're so special. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is the easiest yes I've given throughout the whole competition. Congratulations. Where do I go now? <laughs> go and see Dad. We can't wait to see you. Incredible. Oh my God! Oh my God! That was tremendous. She was amazing. Come here, you had nothing to worry about oh whatsoever. Gosh. Well done. How do you well feel now? I'm going to sleep so well tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Well done. Don't you dare to dream. Really do come true. Waiting to face the judges is a country boy whose day-to-day -day life is a world away from performing in front of a live audience and three judges. My name's Kevin Skinner, 35 years of age. I'm from Mayfield, Kentucky, and uh, I play guitar and write songs. In the country, things move just a little bit slower than they do in the big cities, you know. I'm a down-home kind of country boy, you know, I like to hunt and fish and take a truck mud and things like that. It can get real interesting. It's nice to sit out on the porch, you know, quiet, just a good place to gather all your thoughts and, you know, maybe even count the stars. When I go out on stage, uh, I hope that the crowd, you know, uh, will like what I'm doing. Are uh, you ready? I'm ready to do it, man. All right, go get them. Country guy right there. Okay, welcome, sir. How are you, man? I'm fine, man. And what's your name, sir? Uh, my name's Kevin Skinner. Oh, uh, Kevin, and uh, what are you going to do for us today? Uh, I'd like to sing a song for y'all with my Garth Brooks. Okay. <laughs> and what do you do? Uh, do you do this for a living? Do, exactly. do, you do, do you do this for a living, or do you have another yeah. job? And well, I, uh, yeah, I was a chicken catcher up for several years. Kidding me, chicken catcher. Um, how, how many chickens did you catch in a day? Uh, well, I'm not a math, real good at math. <laughs> we caught about 60,000 in one night, six guys. <laughs> now, one person caught eight at a time. <laughs> okay, that's it.
just to see the act. Thought crosses my mind If I never wake in the morning Would she ever doubt the way I feel about her in my heart if tomorrow She know how much I loved her And did I try in every way To show her every day She's my only one And if my time on earth were through She must face this world without me is the love I gave her in the past gonna be enough to last tomorrow will never come so tell that someone that you love is what you're thinking of tomorrow Pierce, what do you think, brother? As a moment in every season, I can remember them all. When somebody comes on stage, dressed like you are, and your cap's on the wrong way round, and you know, <laughs> then we're all like, this is going to be a total car crash. And then you start to sing, and within about 20 seconds, you have me. And by the end of it, that was one of the most emotional, me too. powerful performances I've seen in a long time. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. That means it, means a lot. Thank you. Sure. Um, you know, you, you come on here and you just like, I, I thought that you were going to be really hokey and silly, but you're really not, and you, I can tell you're a lovely person. Thank you. You're a very genuine man. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. very, very genuine. And you moved us, man. You did a great job. Congratulations, and America deserves Thank to you. see you. Thank you. Hear what this show's about. Let's vote. Sharon? It's a yes. Pierce, you're the real deal. Yeah. You could win this competition. I'm a yes. Thank you. A true yes, brother. Congratulations. Thank you're you. Going to Vegas. How's it feel? I feel a lot of emotions right now, you know. Take, you know, years of trying, you know. Hey, man, it's all coming together. Your Callum, Jade's brother. Are you okay? Yeah. Oh, well, tell us a little bit about yourself, please. I'm 26. I'm from Hull. Uh, and I'm singing a cover of a song by Robin. I love Robin. Yeah. It's dancing on my own, but it's a bit slower. Okay, whenever you're ready, good luck. <clears throat> Thank you. <clears throat> Somebody said you got a new Does she love you better than I can? And there's 
There's a big black sky over my town I know it, I bet she's around Stilettos and broken bottles I'm spinning around in circles And I'm in the corner Watching you kiss her Oh, oh, oh And I'm right over And I'm giving him my all, but I'm not the guy you're taking home. Ooh, I keep dancing on my own. So far away, but still so near. The lights come on, the music dies But you don't see me standing here I just came to say goodbye I'm in the corner watching you kiss her oh. And I'm giving it my all I'm not the guy you're taking home Still so near The lights come on The music dies But you don't see me Standing Songwriter from Lufkin, Texas. I'm 34 years old. Dave, you gonna play this for us? I'm gonna try. All right. Look like you've been ha you had it for a while, huh? <laughs> Music, uh, it has been the only thing I've been good at. I, I was good at sales. I had real jobs back in the day, but you know, over time, it just. Music kept pulling me back. <laughs> you've been at it a while too, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Well, music never leaves you, man. You know that. I've been singing for the last 10 years of my life, basically in honky-tonks and bars, and and not that I don't love it, I do, but I've got a wife now, and, and I want to build a family. My wife's amazing. One of my biggest supporters, she's my saving grace. And so it's time to start doing things that, that can put me on the next level. I can't believe that this opportunity is here. This is something that could change my life. Well, what could you ask more than that? I go get it. What's your name? I'm Dave Finley. And you are going to sing for us. I'm gonna try. Love to hear it. You wanna hear it? Yes. Here we go. You know I'm not one to break promises. 
Did you like it, Mel? I like that a lot. Awesome. <laughs> a lot. You had the soul, the raspiness, you were in your own world, but you entertained us all. I love everything. Is it what you want, what you really, really want? Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> well, let me ask you something. How long have you been doing this? 10 years. So for a decade, you have had this gift. I've been practicing. I know you've been practicing. <laughs> and not until tonight have you been discovered. That is amazing. You have just been discovered, young man. Thanks. Yeah, it's exciting when we meet a guy like you. I thought you were really good. And the audience agreed. And you got a pretty damn good voice. So I was very impressed. Awesome. I'm very excited. Let's vote, guys. Howie. Oh, yeah. Mel. <laughs> yes. Woo. Howard. He's got a great voice, and I say yes. And it's a yes for me. You're going to Las Vegas. What's this moment mean to you? I mean, it's the world. Uh, it's amazing to be able to have this moment right now. All right, man, what's a special moment? Thank you so much. See you in Vegas. Absolutely. I'm never excited when a singer comes out because I think the show is so much more. He was excited. He was excited. Hi. Hey, baby. Hey. <laughs> I, I made it. I'm going to Vegas. <laughs> oh, my God. That's so exciting. What's that do to give you a big hug and kiss? I love you so much. I love you. You found me. Collins, I'm 19, and I work in a computer shop in Plymouth. And you're playing the guitar for us, obviously. Yep, and singing as well. And singing as well. He's very good at this. I live with my mum and dad in a caravan site called Notter Bridge in Saltash. It's, it's not too bad, actually. It's quite posh, really. It's got to have a little key card to open the gates, things like that. So, it's pretty good. Now, who have you got down here with you today? I've got my, my mum, my dad, and my fiance. Oh, wow, OK. Hello. My fiance's called Sarah. Got a baby on the way. It wasn't planned. But obviously it just happened. About a year and a half ago, I proposed to her. Um, bit of a stupid place to do it, but a, in a place called Buffet City, a sort of all-you-can-eat Chinese restaurant <laughs> in front of her mum and her sister. She was embarrassed and started crying. <laughs> so, but Chinese in a pint, it's got to be done. The only competition I ever entered was uh, Not Just Got Talent at my local pub. If I'd go on to win the competition, um, play in front of the Queen, so what was it called again? <laughs> the Royal Variety. <laughs> Again. Um, that would just be class. I would just love to do that. Shut up, Have fun out there. Enjoy. All righty then. Hello, sir, and welcome to Britain's Got Talent. What is your name? My name's Michael Collins. So where are you from, buddy? I'm from Plymouth. And what are you doing for a living now? Oh, I'm an IT engineer. Okay. 
And Michael, what is your dream? To be a successful recording artist, so lots of albums, play all over the world. All right. And do you think your talent will get you to the finals in the 100,000 pounds? I hope so. All right. Stage is yours, Michael. Good Thank luck. Yes. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. He looks like he's going on a long haul flight. Mm. On easy jet. Yes. We've got a fat ass car, and I want to get to anywhere. Maybe we can make a deal. Maybe together we can get somewhere. Any place is better. Starting from two, got nothing to lose Maybe we'll make something Me and myself, I got nothing to prove It's brilliant Wow! I think it's brilliant Love it! You got a fat ass car But it's fast enough so we can fly away We gotta make a decision Or we can stay here and live and die this way Driving, driving in your car Speed was so fast, felt like I was wrong The city lights stayed out for us Your arm felt nice right around my shoulder And I, I had a feeling that I belong And I, I had a feeling I can be someone Be someone, be someone <laughs> reaction we got all day. Congratulations. <laughs> I thought you sang well. You sang well with heart. You put the song across and you did a beautiful job. Thank you very much. Well done. Um, Michael, I don't know what I expected, but I didn't expect much from you, to be honest. You, you've got a really interesting quality to your voice and, and you really delivered. <laughs> Thank you. Michael, so you come out, um, you're an IT engineer, you're dressed in your sherbet leisure wear, you plonk yourself down, and then out pops a great voice that instantly connected with the audience. It was an instant moment. Uh, Amanda. Um, yes. yes. Michael. Uh, yes from me too. Yes. Michael, Britain's got talent, and you are it. Three yeses. Yes. Come on. Woo! Hey! <laughs> well done. How was that? That was amazing. Enjoy. Best experience of my life. Really? So I've never been out playing in front of that many people. It's just levels and levels of people. It's yes. Just and, and we, we absolutely loved it. Could you feel that from them? Yeah, it's just been slapped in the face, basically. Well Fantastic. done, well done, Great pal. Job. Can't wait Cheers to see you Great again. Job. Cheers, buddy. Thanks see you a lot. Brilliant. Time. Cheers. Someone not phased by the buzzers today is a man, a guitar, and a passport full of life and adventure. My name's Owen Campbell. I'm 28 years old. I'm based in Canberra when I'm in the country, but I'm not here much very often. Over the last seven years, Owen has hardly been home for more than a few days at a time. I've been touring in Europe and India and uh, a lot of far-flung places. By touring, I mean busking on the street. Armed with his guitar and his songs, Owen has taken to the streets of the world, performing to get enough food and lodgings to take him to the next town. How much I make in a full session busking, well, uh, that's, yeah, not good. You stay here and look after the house. I came on Australia's Got Talent because Australia's uh, my country and I, I want to play music here. But 
work for someone unfamiliar with Australia of late and even more unfamiliar with Australian TV, today must be rather daunting. I'm always nervous when it comes to performing. You hear a lot about the judges, obviously, so I'll just go in and uh, do my thing and hopefully come out for the best. Performing on our stage is a long way from busking in the cold railway tunnels of the world. So it seems Owen doesn't quite know what to expect from our infamous three. How are you, mate? Where are you from? Oh, I'm from around Canberra, mate. Oh, lovely. Good to see you, Carl, by the way. Yeah, well, that's... Kyle, that's, yeah, sorry. That's name, that's <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, now, now, hey, 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 hey. I wouldn't mind, but it's written in front of you. <laughs> is it? No. How'd you check in, though? How are you, judges? Danny, pleasure as always. Hello. <laughs> now, fellas, this is a non-smoking building as well, so just remember that for uh, when we take off. That's a good start, mate. You're on a flyer at the moment. Well, do you want me to get into it? You yeah. better. OK. Yeah. <laughs> this is a tune of mine, friends. We'll pretend the judges aren't there for a little while and I'll just entertain you lovely folks. Ooh. Righty, is ready. It's called Sunshine Road. What do you say about the judges? Ah. Pretend we're not there, they're not there. Tell you what I need, what I need. The world I don't need much, I don't have much. You're sitting down the dark road, you're sitting in a raincoat. Oh, but Lord, I need just one thing, and it's a little bit of your love. You let me rattle them bones. Yeah. Owen, lovely, very good. Thank you, Very Kyle. enjoyable, very enjoyable. Cheers. Why did you come out and try and make an enemy of us before singing? No, I didn't make an enemy of you guys. <laughs> you know that it's only the three of us that can decide whether you go through. You can impress everybody, but it's down to us. And that was a pretty stupid thing to do because part of being in this industry is you've got to have smarts as well. <laughs> At the end of the day, Okay, you need well, us to say. Oh, no, do you want to let me speak? Do you, wanna, do you just want to keep talking, or do you want us to actually speak to you? Okay, boss. Okay. <laughs> are you are you actually that cocky? Because you are very talented. You're gonna be the most talented guy in the world, and if you if you act like an ass, people won't like you. Well, my aim isn't to be in a boy band, chief. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what. Here's a big lesson learned from you. It's a no from me. Okay. <laughs> You know what? You're probably one of the most talented people that I've seen come through this, but you've got the worst attitude ever. Ever. Okay. No, I and get it's that. A no I from appreciate me, that. Just on your attitude. I can appreciate that. Thanks for sure you can. your honesty. Okay. My turn. Um, I think you are excellent. You are, you are cocky, though. You are a bit cocky. I do uh, apologise uh, if I did come across like that. Uh, well, you did. I want you to get into this competition because I want you to then have the newspapers of this country and the magazines writing complete and utter lies about you and see how you handle it. Because that's what happens to us. So it's a yes from me. Because you're talented, right? Because you are talented. Thank you. Let the woman think. There's people who, who perform for a living, 
And if they want to take it to the next level, they come on a show like this because it's a platform and an opportunity. At 28, why is it that you're that talented and you haven't made it yet? Because uh, I've been uh, enjoying the process of uh, travelling, really. <clears throat> I just... I have to judge you on talent and personality because it's talent and personality that will win this. And on tonight's performance and everything, I would have to say it's a no. Dude, dude, what happened? What was that all about? With one of the most awkward and uncomfortable auditions we've ever seen on this show, Owen leaves with guitar and pride in place, but uncertain of exactly what he did wrong. I was only joking, you know. But, uh, yeah, maybe I've got a bad attitude. So, yeah. I'm Rana Shaknessy, I'm 19 and I'm a songwriter. So I've written a few songs, none that are good though, like I've only written a couple <laughs> that are good. I'm sure there's some that's good. Yeah, well only a few, not many. <laughs> I'd rather play something that means something to me. Like when you're playing your own song, like you put so much more into it, because they're your own, your own lyrics, your own music, you know what I mean? So is singing and songwriting what you want to do? Yeah. Forever? I don't, I don't think I could sit in an office just like working away nine to five. It wouldn't be for me. What kind of music do you do? The song I'm playing, it's about a girl. Uh, one of my best mates that I've been friends with her for about six years, but I'm sort of mad about her. A bit nervous about Simon. Yeah. Seeing what he's gonna say. It's because he's so influential. Like, yeah, and he knows so much. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. If you wanna come over with me? Brilliant. Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Not too bad, not too good. bad. Good. Now tell me something about you. So let's start with your name. Uh, I'm, my name is Rhino Sharknessy. I'm 19. I'm from Dublin. Okay. And I'm a songwriter. So, Ryan, is this something you do full time? No, I'm actually in college at the moment. I'm studying it, so it's something I want to do full time. Okay, and, and we're going to hear one of your own songs today? Uh, yeah, I'm playing my own song, yeah. What's it called? It's called No Name. And what's the inspiration behind this song? It was about a friend of mine that I've liked for a few years now, so... So it was, a, it was like a love letter? Close to it, yeah. And has she responded to this? Um, she hasn't heard it yet, so... What's her name? Oh, I... Oh. Her full name? Kind of in this now with both feet, so you might as well reveal. Uh, her name is. Uh, her name is. No, I, I can't. I can't. I can't do it. I can't do it. It won't come out. It won't come out. Well, give me the first letter. <sighs> it's, it's, uh... Don't you don't have to. Don't do it. <laughs> no, I, I. I. I really can't say it. All right, Ryan. Well, look, best of luck, and I hope this works. Thanks very much. can fly, the road is long, no wonder why One of these days you'll realize what you mean to me Oh, every now and then I see a part of you I've never seen I really like it. It's good, isn't it? Yeah. Well, I try to talk, but I can't my soul has turned to steel This happens every now and then When I try to tell you just how I feel 
So if you ever love somebody You gotta keep them close When you lose grip of their body You'll be falling Cause I'm full Beautiful songs I've ever heard, sung incredibly well. It was absolutely astonishing. Well done. Thanks very much. Cheers. Ryan, that was really sweet and sincere. I just really enjoyed it. And I felt it. It was very lovely. Well done. Thank you very much. Have you played her that song? No. <laughs> so this is the first time she's ever going to hear it? Yeah. Wow. If that doesn't work, nothing will. <laughs> I'm sure you don't want to give me the name? I'm sure. But she's going to know when she watches this, I presume. Oh, yeah, she'll definitely know. Oh, that's even more romantic. <laughs> she'll know. I think you've got a brilliant sense of melody. I think your lyrics are superb. And I love your voice. I think you're great. Thank you really good. I appreciate it. OK, we're going to vote. David, yes or no? Easiest decision I've ever had to make, yes. I'd love to hear you sing again. It's a yes from me. Ryan, I think good things are going to happen on the back of this audition. You're through to the next round, three yes. Crazy. Got to find out who it is. <laughs> the story of the song made it so much more powerful. It couldn't have gone better. It really, couldn't could really it? have it. Nah. Oh, I don't even know what to say. My mate is so dry. I'm so <laughs> nervous as well. <laughs> well whoever this mystery lady is, and I'm not going to push you on it. She'll be watching now, and I'm sure she enjoyed it. Hopefully, hopefully. See you in the next round. Cheers. Thank well you. Done, well Thank done. you. Well done. Thank you. Well done. See you Hello? Hi. What song are you going to sing for us today? I'm going to be singing She's Always a Woman by Billy Joel. All right, we'll wish you luck. Thank you very much. She can ruin your faith with her casual eyes And she only reveals what she wants you to see Yes, yeah, she hides like a child, but she's always a woman to me Just changes her mind She'll promise you more than the Garden of Eden That she'll carelessly catch you and laugh while you're bleeding 
But you bring out the best and the worst you can be Blame it all on yourself Cause she's always a woman to me Frequently kind and she's suddenly cool She can do as she pleases, she's nobody's fool And she can't be convicted, she's on her degree Blame it all on yourself, cause she's always a woman to me Hello there. Hello. What's your name? I'm Sam Kelly. And how old are you, Sam? I'm 19 years old. And have you got a girlfriend? No, I don't have a girlfriend. Oh. <laughs> and what would winning the show mean to you? <laughs> uh, pretty much everything. I grew up in uh, rural Norfolk, farming background, and never really fitted in <laughs> with the working bracket of my family because I'm pretty much useless at everything except music. <laughs> so, um, and do they know you're here today? Uh, my sister's here, and <laughs> my mum knows I'm here, yeah. And what does she think about you doing this? I think she'll kill you if you don't let me through. Really? <laughs> as far as she's concerned, I am the best musician in the world. Let's hear what you've got. Thank you. the song it was so delicate it felt really genuine and honest and that was a beautiful moment so well done I, I don't know what it was but I, I've never kind of felt quite so moved yeah it was, it was beautiful good luck good comments this um, I think uh, when you tackle a song like that it's not just you know your voice it's the way you make us believe that you've lived every line of that song I was completely blown away Thank you. Thank 
I, I've got to tell you, Sam, when you've got absolute silence in a room like this, you've nailed it. I think you've got an amazing voice. Um, it's a yes from me. Lisa? It's a yes from me. Well done. I loved it, yes. Well, Sam, your mum's 100% right. That's a yes to me. Well done. <laughs> you had every single one of them in the palm of your hand. You really oh, did. Thank you. How was that? Hello. What's your name? Uh, my name's Ella Shaw. Hello, Ella Shaw. How old are you? I'm 18. Do you write your own stuff? Yeah, I'm going to sing one of my own songs for you today called Summertime. Summertime. What's the song about? It's about summer without somebody, but how it's still a happy time of the year. OK, brilliant. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> oh, baby girl. Summertime is creeping in. Really good. Shines is melting all my cold and cares away. So maybe this year my summer blues won't stay. Because sometimes it's chasing all those girls' clothes. Away and boys' eyes are rising as they figure out what it is they should say. Time for romancing, slow dancing, enhancing the glances. Oh, baby, what a ball! 